Mimosa belongs to the Acacia family. There are over 200 species belonging to this family. The Mimosa tree is endowed with feathery leaves, in certain cases flowering and fragrant yellow globes. They emit a sweet scent of violet and orange blossom, having both also a bit of spicy and herbaceous fragrance with a fresh floral note. The origin is supposed to be Australia, now being widespread and cultivated in subtropical and tropical regions all over the world. The flowers provide a special absolute with its important sesquiterpenoid, Farnesol, from where the botanical name Acacia farnesiana is derived. In southern France, particularly in the coastal Mediterranean area, Mimosa is cultivated for the perfume industry. The concrete is prepared from the flowers by solvent extraction with hexane. The absolute afterwards is obtained by alcohol extraction of the concrete. But this needs before a separation of the wax via a special process. The concrete often can present up to 80% of wax. The absolute can also be prepared by extraction with alcohol. One needs 2-3 to three kilos of flowers for about 4 liters of alcohol. This has to remain for 3-4 to four weeks at about minus 5 degrees Celsius. Then the alcohol is separated and distilled and the extract obtained is an olive green to golden or dark yellow viscous liquid, sometimes even a solid waxy mass. The thick resinous absolute should be placed in a hot water bath so that it can liquefy. The third option is the process of placing the flowers in melted, purified natural fat and allow them to stand for several hours, even days. This is called enfleurage. They are then replaced by fresh flowers and the process is repeated until the fat is fully saturated with the fragrant particles of the flowers. After this, the fat is melted, strained and cooled and this constitutes the so-called pomade. Alors on a le vous avez vu que la parité, nous sommes déjà en avance, parce qu'on a beaucoup plus de dames qui décorent que de messieurs, hein. donc on va leur faire un peu honneur. Alors, à eux, à elles. Ça dure combien de temps la saison là maintenant Pardon Pardon Trois mois quand même. Ça finit au mi-mars. Ah donc euh, c'est. Non, ça commence maintenant. Ça commence début février Non, 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 on a commencé le septembre. Ah déjà oui. Donc il y avait déjà des mimosas en fleurs en décembre ah, vous les prenez en verre et puis euh, après on est dans les fois dans la forcerie. C'est-à-dire c'est euh, mis sous une température. Euh... Mmh.
Hmm? Bah, c'est très calmant, hein. c'est très, euh, c'est, quand quelqu'un a trop de, d'excitation, oui. nerveux et tout ça, le, le mimose va être très calmant. Hein. Ouais, c'est toujours ouais. calme, alors, <rire> <rire> par exemple. <rire> Mais ce n'est pas une plante qu'on peut distiller, hein. c'est, c'est fait par, euh, par une, un processus chimique. Mimosa absolute is good in case of fever. It is known also as an aphrodisiac and can be used against dryness of skin. A decoction of the green pods is used against dysentery and skin inflammations. It is used also against fever, rheumatoid arthritis, tuberculosis and muscle spasms. A tea made from sweet acacia or mimosa is used against gonorrhea. As a food item, the leaves are used as a tamarind flavoring for chutneys. And pressing its ripe seeds provides oil for cooking. An infusion of the flowers is applied as an insecticide, and the combination of its roots and resins with other components serves to produce incense in Nepal and China. Bark and fruits of Acacia farnesiana are a source of tannins, and its black pigments are used in making dyes and inks. The major biochemical constituents of mimosa are anise aldehyde, benzoic acid, benzyl alcohol, butyric acid, coumarins, and others. And mimosa absolute blends well with lavender and peru balm, any kind of citrus oils, for example, bergamot or mandarin, also with ylang ylang, and other mixes of uh, sweet floral notes. They, they do it only with the so people who take it and cut it for the first time. The, the currants, they cut the bones. The the cut the bones. The the different varieties of the yeah. colors. Yeah, yeah. This, yeah. yeah. And this was. And this was the. Acacia uh, Merinama. Uh, Merinama. Yeah, Merinama. Merinama. Acacia Merinama. Yeah. It means my name. Yeah, Merinama. Yeah, my name. Nama is name. Yeah. There's a monkey in the tree. There's a monkey in it. <laughs> Robert is used to that. Great. <laughs> oh, fabulous. Thanks, Robert. I need to get out. So until now, yeah. is it not so much uh, exploited if, if for no. absolutes? No. It's just starting. No. It's exploited only for the smell. Very nice. You see, this is uh, this is a leaf. Okay, and this is the this, this is, is the, the inflorescence. Yeah, yeah. No, coming us. Yeah. So blossoming yeah, twice yeah, a year. Yeah, it blossoms. It blossoms twice a year. Mm-hmm. We have in Provence. We have uh, mimosa types. They blossom four times. Four. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It blossoms twice. Actually, yeah, we can hardly see because it blossoms all the time. Yeah. People like them in the gardens when they're down down in the south because they have it all the time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This one. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Oh yeah, that is the uh, yes. mimosa pudica. The mimosa pudica, yeah. and this is touch me not. And in Sanskrit, it's called the Lajjalu. Touch it. <laughs> so, Lajja means uh, shyness. Yeah, yeah. So, that's, that's why the name is Lajjalu, because it's shy to, <laughs> to, be, seen, <laughs> to be seen. I don't know why. And to be touched. <laughs> yeah. And uh, this is very good uh, antiseptic and anti inflammatory. Very good for skin problems, 
eczemas mm-hmm. and uh, what we say anything which is related to uh, blood blood vitiation this is very good and also for hemorrhoids Mm-hmm. this is very good very secret remedy no, not much people knows about it because people think it's a plant which has spikes and yeah. makes pain <laughs> not so much uh, being used mm-hmm. but very effective i give to many patients who are having hemorrhoids which mm-hmm. get wonderful results mm-hmm. hemorrhoids fistula skin inflammations you wash mm-hmm. it with it uh, the inflammation goes <laughs> Don't close. And you say the plant is not electromagnetic, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah, it is. <laughs>